Okay, good morning everyone at the North Wiltshire Barrentry Project. Mark again here in Jersey. Um, just going to give you for this week's uh, footwork drills, but before we do that one, just wanted to say that by looking at everyone's videos from the last week or so, everyone, really great effort, okay, and everyone's feet are really getting moving, so nice pivoting on that left foot, yeah, good split steps, yeah, so really good work, so well done guys for that. Um, so what we're going to try and do today is just try and take that split and the moving just a little bit further, okay? So um, I've got Ethan on the camera today, he's hopefully gonna do a good job for me. So what we're gonna start off working with today, okay, is we're working to the two front corners, okay? But this time, rather than last time with the video, as we're doing our split, our pivot, we were up here, okay? Today we're gonna to try and come down as if we're going down for a lift. So we're getting a little bit lower to the floor, okay? So we're gonna make work into the forehand, and to the backhand, you'll notice today I haven't got a racket, okay, because I'm in quite a small area, but if you've got a bigger area, then please use your rackets and try and practice the shot as well. I can't do that in here because I'm probably gonna break it on the road. If Ethan, if you can pan down, I've got a shuttle on the floor, okay? Come back to me, Eve. Okay, so what we're gonna try and do from here is working on the split, the left foot, okay, and then coming down into the shot, okay? Now, what I don't wanna try and get here is, I think for a lot of you, the shuttles on the floor might be a little bit too low. If, if you feel like it's too low on the floor, okay, as you do your split step from here, I don't want to see this kind of a thing here because you're trying to get right the way down to the floor, okay? So what I'm going to try and do today is use something else with a little bit more height on it, okay, to give yourself a chance, okay? And all we're going to try and do is touching it, so from here, so we do from here, nice and ready position, yeah, our split, left right play the lift moving back land open okay then we go down to the backhand the split left right touching it from here back to here again okay one thing i want you to remember okay keep it within a distance which is quite comfortable for you okay if you feel like you're moving or you've lunged quite far okay what you need to remember with this foot here if i start to lunge from here and i find myself like this with your non-racket foot, we need to slide it. So then you get your balance back. And we should be sliding it on the inside of your big toe, okay? Not this one here, okay, like that, yeah? There, dragging the inside of the big toe, okay? So we're gonna do from here, nice ready position, okay, from here. We're gonna go split, one, two, play the lift, one, two, split, one, two, split, one, two, split, Split, left, right, push it back, split, left, right, keep it in a tempo, yeah, yeah, play the lift, nice and ready again, playing the lifts, okay, that's going to be our first one, okay, so what I'd like you to try and do, 10 movements, okay, if you feel like 10 is okay, you can do 12, 14, however, however many you think that you can do, okay, nice split, racket, non-racket foot, Coming down, lift, one step back, land. Push straight into the next corner, okay? Working down nice and low. Once we've done that, we're gonna try and add a little bit of fast feet, okay? Because in those videos which we've been seeing for the last week or so, great steps, but just a little bit slow. I know you're trying to get the feet in the right order, but now we need to try and make sure we get on these toes a little bit, add a little bit of tempo, okay? So what we need that, we need fast feet. Okay, so what we're gonna try and do here, okay, on the middle, okay, my cameraman here, okay, I'm gonna pattern my feet, okay, Ethan is gonna shout split, okay, and then I'm gonna split my feet and move to the first one, the forehand. Coming back, back into pattering, when my cameraman shouts split, I'm gonna to move to the other side, okay, I'm gonna try and do 10, all right? So we're just trying to add a bit more tempo, a little bit of a patter, get on the balls of our feet, Hands nice and ready, okay, moving down. Okay, camera round, are you ready? Yeah. Here we go, ready? Split. 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 Oh, I went, I cheated a bit there. Split. Okay, that'll do. Nice and fast, nice and crouched and ready. Good split, and then we move, okay? Again, 10 movements, yeah? 
See how you feel. If it tends too much, you can go to eight. Ten's not enough. You can do a little bit more. Okay, whoever's holding the split or shouting the split, hold them a little bit, sometimes a bit quicker. Okay, mix it up a little bit. Hard work, so you can see I'm a little bit out of breath already. Okay, so good luck guys. Okay, there's another one coming which now we are gonna work in. We've been working on these ones down to the front. Okay, let's try and make sure we're working a little bit to the back. Okay guys, second part of the footwork this week, we're gonna work on the overheads, all right? So we've just done some nice work coming down to the forecourt. Yeah, nice, no lunges, working on the split. Now let's work on the overhead, all right? So what we're gonna try and do from here, like we did last week, okay, with a split and a nice pivot, okay? Moving back a little bit, nice jump. This time try and pretend we're playing a clear, okay? Moving back forward, landing the split. Try and get a nice tempo going, don't feel like it's a bit too stop-start. Nice and bounce from the toes. Here we go, nice demo, nice and ready for me. Okay, from here, ready, split, pull back, little sit down, load the legs, jump off the floor, play the clear as I land, sit down, nice soft landing, lift the feet, land back in the open stance. Try and put it all together from here, here, clear, lift the feet, there, clear, clear, land, pull back, clear, land, pull back, good jump. Okay, we're landing open on this one because we're playing a clear. If we're hitting the shuttle up in the air, we need to make sure that we're landing open in case your opponent is hitting and you might have to defend on the next one. Next one, we can do 10 of those. Nice jumps off the floor, nice soft landing, no landing heavy. This one here, we're attacking. So this time, up off the floor, playing a smash. So now we want the weight forward, not open. So we start in our fencing position from here, okay? Pulling back, squat down, big jump, just like we see the Chinese and the Indonesians do, really get high off the floor, smash. And then as we push forward, keep your racket foot in front because we're looking to try and keep on the attack. Starting ready, racket ready, pulling first from here, here, jump, smash, here, push back, smash, here, push back, smash, yeah, really get off the floor, yeah, big jump, smash, land, okay, nice gap between the feet, hands nice and ready, really getting off the floor, again, maybe work on 10 to begin with, do a few sets, keep jumping off the floor, keep it in a rhythm which is fast enough, where you don't feel like it's too slow, Keep it within a range where you feel like you can control the movement. Okay guys, good luck, keep working hard. See you next week.